Okay, it's Sunday, so happy Father's Day to all the dads out there. Uh, today, we're gonna run you through a little car wash video here. It's gonna be a little bit different than some of the others you've seen out there. We are not pro detailers. Get that right first thing here. So we're just like 99.9% .9 of the people out there watching, wanna look after our car. Got some products we picked up here, and uh, soon I'll get the uh, little one out here and we'll have some fun. Well, let's uh, get into it because number one thing that uh, we've got to do is teach our kids some life skills. So, you know, every kid should be able to check the oil and, and also washing the car. So if you think your kids sit at home playing too much Fortnite or watching TV and you're one of these old fogies that always complain about, you know, back in my day, we always used to get outside and play and kids today are always inside. Well, this is your chance to have some fun with the kids washing the car and uh, we'll show you how to do it. Birds probably did poo all over my car, you're right. Yeah. You know what we'll do first? You see this one? You yeah. know what it says? It says in audio, it says, bugger off. Look at all the bugs. See some bugs here and here, see? Yeah. We'll spray this one on. Yeah. Do you reckon you can do it? A little yeah. bit? That's it, that one. So before we wash the car, we're gonna put this one on. Uh, basically, it's a bug and tar remover, so that should help loosen up all the dirt and uh, get rid of all the stuff that we don't want on there before we spray it with the snow foam. So uh, this is magical stuff. It uh, really works really well. So we'll start with the snow foam now. So here's uh, the real jewel in the crown, the one that all the kids love, the, uh, the Bowden snow cannon. So this will, <laughs> this will shoot some foam out. Yes, I'm gonna do it now, sweetheart. You're gonna do it. It's really easy to use. You can um, pretty much go on Bowden's own website and it'd be one to suit any pressure washer. Yeah, here you go. It's your go. Go. That's it. Get it everywhere. That's it. Are you like Elsa? Uh -huh. Yeah. Comment below how many times, if you're a dad, you've had to watch the, the movie Frozen. Yeah. Pick them up to about a dozen times. Is that your favourite movie? Yeah. yeah it's Elsa. Elsa, yeah. It's Dad's favourite movie too. There's a scary bit in Elsa too. Is there? Oh, I don't remember that bit. Really? Well, now we have to rinse it off. And then we put our own soap on. So, you know what this is going to do? What? It loosens up all the dirt, so it's even easier to wash it when we have to wash it. it? We'll rinse it off, and that's loosening all the dirt. So make it super easy to wash it now. Here, do you know what we're going to do now first? What we'll do is the wheels. See, now, because the wheels get so dirty, you need to spray a special wheel on. Do you see this? Yeah. It, it's a colour changer. So it goes on, then it changes colour. And do you know what this says here? Yeah. It says, no longer smells like, it's a naughty word, Ass. <laughs> Is that a daddy word? Better not say that one. All right, you want to spray it here? You spray this one and I'll spray the other one. You tell me if this one smells different, because this one apparently is the old one and it smells different. You keep spraying, that's it. You spray that wheel, that's it. And I'll spray this wheel over here. You can see the colour when it reacts with all that brake, dust and dirt and grime in here. It actually changes to that really cool looking purple colour so you know it's working. What's that? It's gone purple. Do you want to scrub the wheels a little bit? Like this? So just do this, dip it in the water, that's it. And then just scrub the wheels. Oh, over, the, over to the one that says wheels. No, next one, next one. That's it. So then we'll do the other two on the other side. Whoa, look how dirty it gets. And then you put it in here and all the dirt goes down. All right, other side. Let's go to the other side of the car. So we we'll rinse off the wheels. Do you know why we do the wheels first? Because the wheels are so, so dirty that if we did them last after we washed the car, we'd just spray all the dirty wheels all over the car again. Whoa. That's it. All right, two more to go. Let's go do the other two. Two more to go. Good job, have you done that before? What? See how it's all dirty? Look at this. See how this is dirty here? Do you know what you do? This is why you use two buckets, because you come over here, see this one? This says rinse. So when it gets all dirty like this, you put it in here, and you get it wet, and squeeze it. Okay. And then all the dirty water comes out. You wanna yeah. try that? Yeah. yeah. And then you put it back in the one for, this is wash, and that's got all the nice clean stuff. And you put it in there, and then you go back, and you can wash the car again. That's it. That's a super good job. 
Yeah, go you dip it in there and then give the sponge to me and I can wash the wash one side of the car. All right. So this is how I'm going to do it. So I'll do big strokes. What I'm going to do is wash the first two thirds of the door essentially because the bottom third is super super dirty. So wash the bubbles. I'll wash here and I'll wash the bubbles that she's putting there first. Now I'm going to do some of the bottom now. This is called a uh, three-way, so you've washed the car, you think it's clean, it's not actually, uh, actually fully clean. There's lots of iron contaminants and dirt and grime that's trapped in that clear coat that it's damaging the paintwork. You spray this on and you'll see it change colour to show that those contaminants are in there. So we'll do that now. Use a clay rubber or we've actually got a, um, a clay towel, so you can use a clay bar, but uh, we've got something a bit different from them. So we'll spray it on now and check it out. Yeah, here you go. So with those deposits like that, um, in seven normal clay bars, this is clay rubber. So unlike a clay bar, if you drop it, then it's basically throwaway. This, uh, you can just wash and then keep on using it. So uh, we'll now just, you can actually feel it. I don't know if you can hear it, but it's picking up a lot of surface contaminants and really giving the paint a nice, uh, a nice deep clean, which it's really important. It's the difference when you rub your hand over sort of paintwork and it feels rough to touch. This will now be really, really smooth and I can hear it picking things up on the surface. Uh, so last part, we've washed it. We've rinsed it down. Ties are all done. Uh, now we've got to chamois it. So I won't just normally just use a normal chamois and wash it done. I've uh, got these two big cloths here from Bowden's as well as this stuff called Fully Slick. So this will give a nice uh, protective coating as well as a UV guard. Uh, and you just spray a little bit on and then chamois the car. All right, so lucky last to finish off the proper car wash is some tyre sheens. So these tyres are a bit wet at the moment, so we'll let them dry. But uh, we'll spray this on first and there's, uh, there's no work basically. Just spray it on and it'll dry in place. And, and that's it, so what we'll, uh, what we'll do, but we'll let these uh, tyres dry first and we'll spray this on a bit later. So there, that's it. Happy Father's Day to everyone out there. Hope you have a really great day. Super easy thing to do with your family. Easy activity, washing the car, as you can see. Looks a million bucks now. Uh, you don't have to be a pro detailer. Easiest thing to do, get some of this gear. Head over to bowdenzone.com.au. Check out your nearest retailer for some of this stuff. Uh, do yourself a real favour if you want some tips on how to do this stuff because I'm a complete amateur and what I did to know how to do this was actually go to Bowden's own Instagram account. Those guys post stories daily on how to maintain your car, look after it. Best Instagram uh, feed going around so thanks to those guys for supplying some of this gear for us today because uh, without it this video wouldn't be possible. So yeah, hope you enjoyed it and um, enjoy the day.